Um, it was investigated and investigators were unable to find a, a, a cause um, of uh, either f um, fire. Uh, you know, whether I'm trying to sell it and having difficulty selling, my, my feeling is uh, whether I'm white right or not is uh, stinks of arson uh, a little bit uh, to me. Welcome back to the uh, channel guys. Today we're standing outside uh, a Thai massage parlour, but don't worry, we're not actually going to be uh, videoing uh, that. I've got something much more uh, interesting. Um, it's what we've uh, what we've got. We've got a, a really old pub that uh, got burnt out uh, a couple of years ago. So <coughs> I'll cut to uh, cut to it. So um, the White Horse Pub, um, as you can see, sort of down. I'll zoom in. Uh, on that, uh, the White's Pub originally uh, dates back to 1602 uh, when uh, Edward Crow was uh, Victoria. Um, I put some photos in here and uh, a few links in the description of what the pub uh, actually used to uh, look like. And the uh, the actual inn um, can be found in old country directories going back to 1826 onwards. Uh, the Orchard Group actually took over the pub in October, uh, sort of 2007. So a quick look at that. And uh, the pub closed its doors for the last time in August, uh, sort of 20, uh, 2017. Uh, I'm just going to zoom in uh, on the pub. Yeah, so like I said, it closed its doors uh, for the last time in uh, August 2017. And uh, one regular um, to the pub said that the uh, last owners allowed the pub to uh, de deteriorate. And his view was uh, because they actually wanted to uh, sell the land. Uh, at the end of August 2017, uh, the 0.8 acre site uh, was listed with uh, Kingsbury Investments and Development Consultants at a price of uh, £4 million. Uh, at 4.47am uh, on Sunday the 20th of September 2020 uh, the pub uh, caught fire uh, and 40 fire, uh, firefighters had the blaze under control uh, by uh, 17 minutes past 7am a second fire um, happened on uh, Monday uh, January the, uh, the 18th 2021 and um, it was investigated and investigators were unable to find a, a, a cause um, of uh, either f um, fire, uh, you know, whether I'm trying to sell it and having difficulty selling, my, my feeling is uh, whether I'm white right or not is uh, stinks of arson uh, a little bit uh, to me. Uh, it's all boarded up from the outside, but let's have a bit of a, a closer uh, look around the uh, around the sides. So this is one definitely for the drone because it's uh, well uh, well boarded up. Just waiting to uh, to cross the road. Should be able to get across if I want. Can't really see anything at least it's well uh, sort of balled it up. It's 
see if we see it from the uh, around the sides. So yeah, you can't really see anything uh, sort of from the uh, from the sides. I know it's probably had a really big beer garden uh, at the back. It's probably well overgrown considering the, uh, the fire happened uh, sort of four or five years ago now. But uh, we'll stick Beverly up and uh, we'll, uh, we'll have a look through it looks like uh, from above. Right, I'll bring it, back, uh, bring it back to you guys when I've got Beverly in here.
Okay, guys, that's the uh, the drone footage. As you can see, the uh, you know quite a bad uh, fire's completely uh, sort of gutted out, uh, sort of the in uh, inside. Uh, there's not much else to see, um, sort of at, at the uh, the moment. Uh, is uh, so I want to call it a wrap on uh, on that one. So if you uh, if you like what I see, give it a, a, a thumb, give us a thumbs up. Uh, please subscribe, please share. And uh, see you on the next one. Have a great day. Okay, a bit of bonus uh, footage, guys. Just a bit of um, sort of um, sort of information, really. Uh, next to the uh, the um, White Horse Pub, there's uh, St Chad's um, sort of uh, church, and um, it's quite interesting. This church, it's a sort of a red brick uh, built church and it first opened in March uh, 1886 and the uh, the clock tower and I'll just uh, zoom in uh, sort of on the um, the clock tower uh, was built to celebrate the diamond jubilee of Queen Victoria and was a gift for TH Sale of the Bengal engineers so that's just a bit of a bonus footage to tag on the end of the uh, the last one okay have a great guys and see you on the next one